Yeah, Ladies yeah, and up. gentlemen, welcome back to another Folk in Scotland. We're just, we're the same. How, nah, this well, is, we're, we didn't do one after the other because we're... Well, we're in the same clays, but this has all been washed. Washed, yeah. Now, in the last one we done last few days ago... Days. Medicine, I can't even We didn't stay on topic. And we're, I would like to stay on topic okay, on this one. you'd like to. This week, you suggested... Not, I didn't go, what we're going to do, what we're going to do And you yeah. just said the first word that came to mind That didn't happen, we really put thought into this mm-hmm. But this week Pets Pets I have not much to say on this subject Oh Jesus Christ <laughs> I'll, t- okay. I'll, I'll give Pets. you one I was on a bus Uh huh. Going home from my work mm-hmm. About ten years ago That's a spell When you were I was on. I was on, oh just shut up I was on the bus the 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 called the the um oh, what was this the the place in um Iraq that was all the trouble Most Helmand. Of Helmand 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 Express. it was called the Helmand yeah so I was on that and it was just chaos and people junkies and fighting and swearing and kids going it was just awful and there was a guy I think I told you this before he mm-hmm. was talking and goes ah oh, it's, it's me and me and me and young Dave, eh? Me and young Dave. And I'm like, all right. Me and young Dave, we're out of the pub. All right, okay. Hey, you been in that pub? No, no. But me and young Dave, you want to meet young Dave? And I went, oh, Jesus. I didn't have it. Well, whatever. And he puts his and hand. And the And he pulled out a little tarantula. Oh, fuck. So one, I went. <coughs> and two, I had no hair on it. And it just, it was shivering. It was just this wee tarantula. A tarantula can live for a decade, couple of decades. I was like, "That's awful." Well, you got a tarantula in your pocket? No, for? no, but the minks, the minks, clear the fucking seats. I'll tell you, the minks, the standard pet of the 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 scummy minky bastard. Mm-hmm. Sorry if any scummy minky bastards listening. <laughs> is a Staffordshire bull terrier. Yes, now, not now. It's now the husky. Oh, the husky! Oh, they moved on the husky. the husky. An animal that's supposed to fucking run, and it's just living in a, in a, a windowless flat. Yeah, no, no, that's but terrible. Plus, huskies they also get exotics. That's a big thing. Yes. Now, it used to be when we were growing up, you'd go into a minx house, and they had quite a substantial fish tank. Yeah, somebody you get into fish. That was a fi- a fish yeah. tank was a big thing. Then budgies. Budgies. Well, but you don't see them anymore. You don't well, see the, budgies and fish bu- tanks. Budgies went with the coal mining industry. A lot of people like canaries and budgies. <laughs> <laughs> it was a work colleague. But when I was a kid, it was that. But, but, that but was I wouldn't have a bird in the house. It's bad for you. Bad for your lungs. Oh, yeah. yeah bad for your lungs. But no, the, the the fish tank was... When I used to go down to my friends in Charleston, but it's, every it's, house it's had snakes. a fish tank. <sighs> a snake. But this, if you, if you see the populace of Dundee, they're a bit malnourished. So there's no giant snakes in Dundee. <laughs> you think, what is that? A fucking grass snake? No, that's a python. They're about Jeez, it's a bit under eight fed. inches long. It's 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 six feet long, but it's like a piece of spaghetti. <laughs> we a big head in the end. Okay? Oh god! What did they feed it? Tadpole. You see this all the time. There used to be a, a axolotls are big. An axolotl? What the fuck's that? It's like that salamanders, but they never oh, serve right, the gills. Yeah. yeah. Okay. They 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 can only be found in the environs of Mexico City. That's only place they they exist. That's crazy. In, in the wild or Whitfield. But yeah, but they're the they're the, they're the most common a lab animal next to rats, I believe. Because an axolotl, this would be handy for Dundee knife fights. If it loses a hand, it regrows it. Oh right. It loses its tail. It can re. It's like a. It's almost like a fetus. Like I'm. I'm led to believe, in the womb, can things can regrow. All oh, right. At okay. that, that stage. All oh, right. Okay. Stage. Interesting. I wouldn't like to put it to the test. <laughs> Snip a baby up. <laughs> Oh, I grew back. I mean, that's what they do. So they're thinking they'll be able to have human yeah, you know, that, that'll, wounds that'll, that'll self heal. It will. That'll, that'll come in yeah, time. Yeah, that will. It'll be thanks to the axolotl. Oh, but right. I was in, came in the old steeple was. Mm-hmm. And there was a guy sat there with like a big shortbread tin mm-hmm. with some grass Uh-oh. and some kidnapped fake shrubbery getting butchers. Yeah. And I was laid about, and on it he had a series of fucking sickly looking, I think it was like a lizard and some snakes and he's begging and mm. i saw the police kind of big sergeant yeah. moustache pc murder guy looking at him and, but just left him he shouldn't have it's just that's awful you can't uh, have animals like that although there is a guy in dundee that i've seen mm. and i've heard about mm. we've talked about this you go down the waterfront high tide rats everywhere uh-huh. but there's a genuine rat king now 
Uh-huh. But the, the guy's a rat king. He goes down and, and uh, feeds them. I think he's playing a saxophone for them. You can hear the saxophone most Jesus. nights when you go past. He's like the Pied Piper of Hamlet. Yeah, but he, he's called really good. He plays really and well. And rats are choosy. Now I'll tell you something. He's been doing that for like 30 years because I used to go down uh, fishing at the waterfront. Right. And he'd be in. You like catching jobbies? Oh, no. You used to get occasional fish here. Not often. With a jobby inside it. Well, yeah. And. There's across from the waterfront. There's a sort of football ground. Oh, there's yeah. grass, oh. and there's a pavilion. Uh-huh. And he'd go facing the corner of the pavi- pavilion in the sort of enclosed bit, and he'd play there from seven in the morning to ten at night, all day. He'd just play saxophone. Is he the ghost of Roy time. Castle? See him all the time, dude. He's a real person, and I was very aware he's of this guy. And Do you he know goes down plays for the rats, and he's got like ten thousand rats around him that listen. The fancy rat thing. Mm-hmm. You know how that came about? Pet mm. rats. Yeah. You'd have rat catchers. Mm-hmm. And that, it was a honourable job. And mm-hmm. m- imagine fucking medieval England. Or yeah, you're Victorian a rat catcher. England, you were Because you need to. Mm-hmm. He, but he, they would spot one that was an albedo one or one that was mm-hmm. a funny colour. And he would catch them and he would breed from them. And it became a thing. And a lot of like... Uh, That's mad. A lot of well-to-do ladies had fancy rats. That's where the... A rat was. is a great pet. One, I've had rats. Wonderful pets. Great wonderful, pets. wonderful Really pets. good. Good friendly There was friends. a thing I watched on the TV and YouTube. There was a guy called maybe Big Dave or Big Bill. Mm-hmm. As the name suggests, Big. Buffon here, like one of the Gibbs. Oh, wonderful. But his mullet was right down to his fat arse. Oh. Big guy. Classic. But he was Ohio Fish Rescue. Give right. a shout out to Ohio Fish Rescue. Absolutely. What he does... People buy like they'll buy cichlids and the various fish mm-hmm. goes into the tank, but the fucking things get gigantic. And he says these pet shops they're selling these fish knowing it's a death sentence because when they get to a oh, certain so size. Yeah. So what he does is he takes in these fish. They're fucking huge. He's got ones the length of this room, right? But he's got tanks, mm-hmm. massive tanks full of gigantic fish. But he's got one. He's converted a swimming pool. It's full of sharks and shit. What? And big Dave Bill with my, he goes in. He's got a picnic table with seats, and you can go in and sit up to here in water. And there's these giant groupers and that all swimming about. Jesus, it's fucking nuts! It's God, a charity. If you want to give some money to Ohio Fish Rescue, give it to us in fucking stead. That's a good point. We we, we don't have any fish. I've got a cat though. Right, like a pet. We're like a goldfish. We are restricted by our environment. Imagine we got fifty pence for every download of forty thousand. Oh, that's that's all right. Think of that. Oh my God, that's a lot. Sobering, isn't it? Eighteen pound eighty. Is it? <laughs> wow, that'd be a lot of money, man. I've got to. That'd cover your cost of your shoes. Yeah, almost. <laughs> I bought two pairs because if I like a pair of what? shoes, I buy you two pairs. You don't spend money on clothes and no, shit. But, no, but fuck? I don't buy money. But if I buy, if I like a pair of shoes in the past, I've liked a pair of shoes, which are made of pets. Uh, they Leather. are. They're made of pets. It's with a job. <laughs> when I buy a pair of shoes in the past, I've liked them, and then I've thought, oh, I like these shoes. Uh-huh. But I went to buy, and they're no longer. Ah, I see. You're the same as me. I get a pair of trainers. Uh, like walking trainers And I stick to them If they work I'll stick to them So what I'll do is I'll, I've, I've bought two pairs mm-hmm. And that's what I'll do And wait leather. How long do they last you? Should last a while Because they're work boots But I don't do any work That's fair enough My shoes like How long these, does a pair of trainers last? Not long uh, Now Because I can't walk as much as no, I did But no. uh, usually it was three months when you turn 50 the last five years Yeah No Because uh, I've walked so much It was uh, three months ago actually me. The foot will rot The sole will be absolutely fine But the foot The upper will rot on your feet Oh the, the stink Well the thing is I, I couldn't spend them. a lot Because no. I remember getting a pair of medals Going oh they'll last no, forever don't. Three months I had to get no. a new pair Well I went shopping And I went into so There's a bit God the centre of town's awful it's dead There's man. not even people with dogs I saw one it's dog em- it's, it's not just the shops are empty No one's going anymore No That yeah But I went in It's terrible d- Dykeman's Dykeman's Oh Shoe shop It's frightening And they were uh, inexpensive shoes That's where I ended up going to But I went to a couple more shops and was, I went to Clark's mm-hmm. And Clark's has decided The way to get people buying Is to curate it So it's like a shoe gallery Ah yeah That's the so old So there's way, a yeah. space in his single shoes mm-hmm. And there's a guy with a headpiece kind of like yeah. annoying you when you go in. Yeah, that's that's an, a, a, a very old way of selling shoes. You know shoe. how much a pair of Clark's like standard sh- men's shoes are? No. £134. What? Yeah. And there was, you know who oh, was in? I can't do that. You know who was in that shop buying shoes? Who? Not a single person that wasn't a pensioner. 
That's true. And then I went into Marquis because mm-hmm. I thought maybe Marquis have got good shoes. Who's buying the shoes in Marquis? Pensioners. So young people, no, they're, they're, they're not. They're not buying. It's finished. The, the centre's finished. The set. No, the centre's hit that tipping point where it's finished because his Tesco's is not there. Yeah, that's a Sports Direct next to it is not there. Mm-hmm. The pound shops are fucking shut next to Tesco's. If a pound shop has closed, I would say we are fucked. Occupancy is something like forty percent. Jesus, it's I've not shocking. been in for a long Empty time. Empty shops, and it's coffee shops that have shut. Oh my There's God. that sushi place is shut. Yeah. Everyone's shut. The uh, a bur- the the burger place. No, the pizza place shut. And f- a place called Fat Burger in Dundee failed in Dundee. Is, oh, Fat Burger. What's going on? They've put all the money in the waterfront. They've put all the money in oh. a building where people visit and don't spend money in the town. That's right. They come into the town and they leave again. Oh my! God. It's designed in such a fashion. You can come in the main mm-hmm. road, park, visit. And then straight out the main road again. You don't have it's to. It's a disaster. That people don't realise is a psychological barrier of that main road. That I right. This has been my issue since the they start. They need a walkway. They need something. You need to make as soon as you put a road. Yeah. See, in, right where I live, on there's a south road that goes yeah, yeah. down from me. On one side of it, everyone sports Dundee. On the other yeah. side, everyone it's sports Dundee United. Yeah. It's a barrier. Yeah. If you put a road in, it's like having a river. It's, it's psychological. They've got crossings and everything, it but doesn't that work. doesn't matter. It doesn't work. People, you need to be able to walk freely. Yes. From the centre. And then we had walkways going over walkways it. Got rid of them all. Do them up. They, they knocked them down. Knocked them all down. Oh, God. It's so weird. It's the but, fucked yeah, up. But the town is it's, it's, it's terrifyingly fucked. And you know what's weird? There's like stains all over the pavement, like spilled stuff. Right, I've noticed My how feet dirty are things are. G- I, yeah, They're like fuck, somebody spilled a milk. No one's doing the the chewing gum pickup. No, nah. because they would jet There's wash that and, and stop. The businesses put their black bags out in the street and there's seagulls at them. It's oh, not good. I got a letter the other day. Um, we have two bins for the house. They said uh, no, you're only allowed one now. You're only getting one bin to the house. One wheelie bin. One wheelie bin. So it's like, how many thousands of pickups are they saving on? Yeah. And it's like you need to keep the centre of aid. Like there's places like Zara's shut. That was that. It, like, Zara's that shutting. Fuck. Things that you think would just be, they would make big, it. Big businesses yeah. fucked. And then there's oh, and there's just, but like I said, I saw one blind dog. Not a blind dog. A sea knife. Blind. Dog. I know it. Yeah, a guide dog. You're guide after. dog. The woman wasn't blind. It was a training exercise. Oh, oh yeah. I, you see them training all the time. I, I went for her and she flinched. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, but it's just folk lying about. Fast Eddie wasn't even there. He's given up. Oh my god! I, I think he's in jail, isn't he? Yeah, well, I, I think he's in jail. But there's again. so many seagulls. Yeah, so it's seagulls. it's really bad. But everywhere's going really wrong at the moment, and like that, it's because it's. But that's not coming from, back. People no. have stopped. You've said, and I've said, both selling stuff online. Mm-hmm. People are spending money. They're just not walking to a shop. The, it's not happening. I'll tell you what, the money is there. Mm-hmm. I have just went through mm-hmm. the. I, and I, I tell like on Patreon, you know, the, the work's sort of coming back and mm-hmm. it was difficult for the last year yeah, and a yeah. half. Mm-hmm. And the last month, I've had the biggest mm-hmm. of month mm-hmm. since I've started business. Nuts. And you're like, so people what? have money. They have money, they just do not but they're want not to going go to a shop. No. Don't want to go to a shop. Don't want to go to a shop. But the thing is, if if you get, get people, I'm not wanting to go into shops again. No, I'm such an a unple- I don't, I'm not a big shopper, mm-hmm. but it's such an unpleasant experience. Mm-hmm. Everything about the centre of town was so terrible. I'm mm-hmm. not want to go back. So they really they can't afford to let it get grotty because it's get just it's just <sighs> yeah. So what they need to do now, mm-hmm. and this is if Dundee councils listen, but they won't the, listen. No, they never. They don't listen to us. They don't listen. They give, to the real done. They give doctorates to fucking people in this town. You're yeah, idiots. That's true. So here's what here's what you need to do. Mm-hmm. You actually need to invest, but not invest as in like courting people to the town mm. you need to say there's going to be a break on uh yeah. what do you call it the what does what's the tax you have to pay vat no the rates rates of because that's no what rates. screws you yeah. no rates how could you run a, a sh- imagine when they're paying for rent in dundee and i went into the this is even when this is a way for pets but we'll get back we'll, we'll, we'll get back we'll you know what we're like we'll pull, it back. we'll pull it back we're experts we'll pull it off the um what? went to the well gate and went upstairs. Well, the escalators weren't working. Mm-hmm. 
all the food court in the world gets all shut. So the Burger King is all shuttered. Nothing's. Oh, there. I've not been in a year, really. So that's all gone. And all there's oh. a gym at the back, mm -hmm. and then there's um there's charity shops. It's like Def Hub, da, 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 oh, that's community just, groups. Yeah. So it's there's no there's nobody upstairs. <gasps> there's a library, but there's I was up there and there was one other person. And oh, there was a security guard. I bet the gym's still open at the, the back. The gym's open at the back. Yeah. There was a plan to turn the well gate into a cinema. A cinema. And thought, well, great idea. But yeah. imagine if they turned in a cinema. That would have been closed. It would been gone. <sighs> oh, it's not looking good. It's not looking good. But this good. was all... Society was heading in this direction. Yeah. But this has just sped up. The pandemic has sped things up like a fucker. We have... I think things could have this held on another five years. Dundee Council has to adapt. Quickly, yeah. They have to adapt. They have to go fast. Now, the, the thing is with them, everyone in the council thinks they're an expert. They're not. They're not. They have to look at other cities people, that are being successful. People in the private sector, mm -hmm. as cuntish as they are, know how to make money. Mm -hmm. The public sector... The council they know nothing do about it. making they money. They have to go to the private. They now, have to, yeah. like we've said before, the... The VNA is going to fail. It is failing. It's going to fail, and it's going to end up in private it'll hands. It'll be a long. No, it's too big to fail. So they'll bail out and bail out and bail out and bail out. I think they'll come out one day and say we're now running it in conjunction oh, yeah. with someone. No, and no. It's bringing exciting opportunities. Yeah. In other words, private. It, it will. In ten years' time, it mm -hmm. will not be the VNA. That's right. It won't be the VNA. It'll be something. It'll be Scottish executive. Yep, that's exactly. It, it, it can only fail. Yeah. It can only it, fail. Yeah. But mm -hmm. this new stadium that's coming and this uh, Eden project, the Eden project, they're going to be fine. The bare bones are are good. I mean, mm -hmm. City Square, it's kind of a little bit sterile, maybe. Yeah, there's too much space. But there's something could happen there, and mm -hmm. you could work. You could get that right, and then spread out empty shops. Can, you could have coffee shop There are some nice coffee shops There's an abundance of places for people to eat mm -hmm. But the thing is They've never wanted people in the centre of town The businesses have never wanted people down there at night mm -hmm. It's always been a wee bit Yeah To keep it Keep it um, if you, and you'll never, You've never seen a place like it Go down to the centre of town at 10 at night There's nobody in the oh, centre it's, it's completely empty Dead Completely dead Dead Not a single soul The it's, shop's all shut There's no, there's no real many pubs Dundee down there. is there are years of mismanagement has yeah. come to a head. Perth Road's quite and busy. Perth Road, Perth nothing Road lies empty. The problem with the Perth Road, they're they're making it for a particular yeah. clientele. Yeah. It's the middle classes yeah, it's a middle have class sorted so themselves out. Yeah. That's fact. all it is. Everyone else is just But dead. it's not for the people of Dundee. There's a farm foods in the centre of town. Have you been in there? It smells no. of urine. Oh I, I, like strong, like old steel farm urine. Foods, man. It's fucking shocking. You know what though? They do amazing sauces, but they're in jugs this big. Mm. But the sauces are great. There's sauces. lots of different mm. chili ones and just oh there's lovely sauces in there. Try them out. A mango chili one I got. Oh <sighs> mango's nice. Really, really good. What kind of pet would eat a mango? Chinchilla? Chinchillas I, live about sixty two years. Well, I was you have to put them in special sand. One night. I was cycling mm, saw a chinchilla. through uh, Camperdown Park mm -hmm. and out on the the, the, the greens, which the, the uh, it's now gone. Oh, the golf course. The golf course shot. is gone. And I saw there. ferrets. Oh, yeah. Loads of ferrets. One big male and his wee harem. Entourage. And I was like, holy shit. Got down, went to the bottom of it on the nature trail. There's a chinchilla right in the middle. Oh. So people go up and just release their pets. But the chinchilla won't last, but the, no, the ferrets, ferrets will. will. Be fine. They'll oh, be fine. Yeah. Because yeah, they're, they're just a pole cat. Yeah, they're yeah. fine. They're tough as fuck. Best pet you'll ever had. I've had ferrets. They are yeah. wonderful. Nibbly. No. No. My cat. They're gentle. My they're lovely. My cat's been getting outside now, and uh, I've had to put a particularly camp, loud belled collar on him. Because mm -hmm. every night he was going out, five minutes later, he's coming back with a pigeon. Oh. Good hunter, eh? He ate one, and then mm -hmm. the second one, he just caught it and mangled it. So yeah. I had to kill it. Oh. Not nice to break oh, his fucking neck. Break his neck. Not Old nice. school in between your fingers like that. Betty, yeah. he, uh, yeah, he's, he just, he literally is out the door and he's back. <laughs> <laughs> we are bird. A big pigeon. Oh, he's a killer. That's a good thing. Betty, the neighbor's cat, but came I mean, then he's started, he, he attacked me three times. Really? Well, he Tough. gets overly excited. Mm -hmm. And when he gets overly excited, he goes for your legs. <laughs> And uh, he went for me and I says, right, that's it. That's it, you're not getting I that. says, I'm going to fucking kill you. <laughs> so I, 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 I basically gave him a bit of a hiding. Right. Nothing rough, but I just, I've I, I got a towel 
and scrunched up and just chased him about the house. If you make Wallop. a noise, yeah, that's chased it. Chased him about the house, walloping him with it and said, look, if you do that to me again, and he was he was a wee bit petrified. So every, you've got to, I think he thought he you was You weren't the boss. hitting him, you were hitting the fucking... No, I was hitting him. Because <laughs> he fucking clawed my legs to bits. Unprovoked attack. Yeah. I wouldn't have that. No, and if I was doing something to him. My boy's not done it for, God, probably a year and a half, but he was going through the phase of every month, I think I run this fucking gut yeah. now. yeah. And then you'd clap him and he'd go to bite you. Yeah. And I'd see it and I went, oh, this isn't fun. So you'd scruff him. Aye. Just lift him up, pull him out the door. He'd walk back in like nothing happened. But yeah, he just needs to know. The dude, he, thought, challenge. he thought he was the boss. Has he got his balls? No, his balls are off. Oh, if God. he had his balls, he he'd just be mental, you, yeah. mental. Luckily, he's only got one fang because he's... I thought, same as my cat. Yeah. yeah, same as mine. Previously, when I got him, I was under the impression he'd been a poor wee soul and he'd been mal treated and yeah. thrown him out in the country my latest thinking on the matter is he's a psychopath he's psychopathic <laughs> he's been attacking people and someone's just kicked him in the head fight. Yeah. it's it's happened yeah and then they've said fuck you and they've thrown him out in the country soon but he's a good he's a good lad can he's dead yeah affectionate he's interested in people my mom and dad visited and he was all can he's fine he's absolutely yeah. fine but when he gets overstimulated he can't take it yeah he just goes bananas taken away from his mum too young that's what that is Possibly Yeah, yeah possibly Possibly yeah. But he's enormous cat, he's My cat's got one tooth as well He come in one day And he just yawned I went what the fuck uh, Like that And it was red raw Straight to the vets Big operation uh, Get it out ah, And that's when I found out You had to get another tooth out uh, And x-ray them Because cats reabsorb their teeth Oh And they, they go spiky And can be really painful But they just break apart And go back and cats, like, have got, what? cats have problems with their teeth Yeah Really bad So But I got them they they said like, he's fine and they give him a proper scale and he says yeah. he'll probably never need that again no, in his life no. you know he's fine yeah but yeah it was a big operation I was all worried because my pal got... Ross with the cape he bought a dog a beagle oh nice he's unable to train it he's well he's never had a pet before because <laughs> his mother thought he wasn't a capable where's the cape yeah where's the cape I bet he, he he didn't train it so it just does its own thing obviously but it came to my house and it ate my mum and dad had made me lovely chocolates mm -hmm. Christmas handmade Belgian chocolates my mm -hmm. dad was a confectioner beautiful under mm -hmm. the Christmas tree Ross's dog ate them <laughs> <laughs> I knew these he's never getting back two that lady. dog yeah I could imagine I knew these two ladies who I say ladies they got a dog oh and the dog just wouldn't fucking listen because they were going now and bending down to it and negotiating. And I was like, he's a fucking lab. He's a working dog. Yeah. Just expect of him. He'll love it. He'll love it. If you if he gets it right. Yeah. The moment he gets it right, he'll go, oh, my life's complete. Yeah. And I had him. We were at the beach one day and he wouldn't listen, just walk off. And I went, right, come here. And I stood up. I didn't look at him. I told him what to do. And within 25 minutes, his nose was at my... Yeah, yeah. Leg the one and fall and he was having a ball like yourself. They need no discipline. shouting at him. They need discipline. You just you're in charge. Yes. He was terrified of water. That day I had him out swimming, mm -hmm. and then he got so good at it. As soon as he saw water, you had to keep him away from it because you just a, dive there, right there's under. There's a lot of dogs in this building that tend to pee themselves. Yes, I know what you're talking about. <laughs> it's a terrible. <laughs> the dog's picking up on stress. I think. <laughs> Beautiful little dog It's stunning But just pissing itself How many dogs were in that litter? Was it about six or seven? I Probably think there was nine nine. And one, nine and one died Oh, I don't know One died The wee runt Yeah The wee One died uh, and then... No, but exotic pets in Dundee Like I say, huskies and malamutes There's a lot oh. of huskies and malamutes If you, there's oh, Well, five minutes that. from here is the pound The dog pound Well, I can't go past it it's And it's all malamutes thing. But like, but it's ridiculous because we're, we're it's puppy farms because people taxi drivers who are the lowest of the low oh. can afford fucking pugs. It's a yeah. two and a half grand dog. The, the animals cost so much now. A dog should not be two and a half thousand pounds. I saw uh, a Maine Coon. Yes, beautiful big giants. A dog, at least a dog, is a good chance it'll live. A cat, a cat will get. Yeah, you're not spending because it'll be not. But down. those cats, main coons, you can't let them out. No, no, they'll just go straight on the road. So, this fucking cat. How much do you think for a, a kitten? Oh come on, what? It's no, it's no two grand. Four thousand pounds. That's obscene. That's ridiculous. 
It's the most expensive thing I would have in my and house. And they're wondering why people, they're wondering why people like exploit the situation because it's, oh my god, this is a recent thing, puppy Four farm. Grand, yeah, when dogs are worth fifty quid, mm-hmm. it's no, it's no worth their effort. It's not. Yeah, the dogs should have a value. Mm-hmm. Now, where the value should be is in the responsibility of them. Mm-hmm. I think the dog license should come back. Oh, I've, I've, without a doubt. But the dog license is every year 150 quid. Yes. That would put people off. Yeah. You just, but they'll spend that money on the dog. Do you know, it's a weird thing. Yeah. But, but when you're giving it to the government sort of thing. poor dogs that for cats and dogs people bought. Folk are so selfish. They want a companion because mm-hmm. they're in the house. Mm-hmm. They get this fucking animal and then they just give it. They, want, they don't want it. Yeah. My, my attitude, I've spoken with my cat, how vicious he can be and all this, but I have a responsibility. Mm-hmm. I have taken on that animal so I have to look after it, it yeah. I will stick with it okay? mm-hmm. I mean I'm not get, To be honest with you If I was to maybe give him back They'd probably have him put down Yeah you're not having that He's not getting rehomed twice You're not I, having that Because some bad behaviour You'll deal no, with it you You're a grown with, up you Yeah, deal with it And his ways around it He is improved But some people The slightest thing A dog pees in their floor And they fucking throw it away no, it's, it's a fucking animal man It's Come no, on You take people, on People People overestimate their pets and underestimate them at the same time. They mm-hmm. think they're they think they're like a person. Like yeah, you say, people that's commun- I've heard people like you've said I've negotiating. Been, yeah, I've been very lucky where you've been brought up saying yeah. that's an animal. Yeah. It's a lovely animal. And you can love it and yeah. care for it and you'll get so much from them that you can't even imagine. Yeah, but it's but not- don't ever assume they're a person. Ever. No, it's it's not, a dog will take your fucking face off that's loved you for years. Yeah. You've, and it's if it's like, pushed its limit mm-hmm. I mean if it's starving And you don't need to, You see guys beating their dogs and everything And you're like what are you doing You don't get to uh, yeah. It's The violence I've seen towards animals Is disgusting Oh you see some right poor You looking. see some real fucking people just punching the dog's face And everything you're like I just report them I get the police right away oh, when I see that uh, I don't give a fuck uh, I've had dogs you don't need to punch them Oh no no Jesus no. Christ if saying that if a dog was do no if a dog better this no wait if a dog's attacking you do whatever's yeah, yeah. required yeah but that's a problem. if the dog's not coming to you quick enough I've seen someone punch them yeah oh, I've seen ridiculous. it thing with a cat is you can't is shit like I said I was given a wallop with a towel but you can't really a it doesn't cat, mean anything a cat a cat you can't really slap a cat like a no, no it doesn't work. you can you could you could scalp a dog in the arse. You can give a dog a whack in the arse if a, it's a dog sometimes growl him. If a dog What happened uh, after uh, My dad died Was the dog went Well I'm in charge now Yeah 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 And I went How, how are you doing Lewis? Mm. She fucking went to bite me Didn't she? Oh. 12 years old Never yeah. bit anyone in her life But she this was her place now Fuck I had to scruff her Putting her in her bed And I said stay there mm. Never she, If you told her to do something She'd done it instantly And she went No I'm not I'm coming out Six hours I had to pick her up Put her back in that bed oh. And then she'd come out And she pissed as well. been She pissed as well. and lay on her back I went that's over Go and lie down She did And then the next day Like nothing had happened oh. And she was a normal wee dog But she had to Go through this whole thing It was terrible Do you know this certain, so The certain vegans On the extreme end No Don't tell me something It's going to make me mad They don't believe that predators should exist <laughs> No, this isn't. <laughs> is this, this real? Is, this is fringy, oh, but this is God. a discussion. Right. So they don't believe any predators should exist. So they think you should tigers, lions, uh-huh. wolves, no, nah, because it creates animal suffering. So they want to live in a world where it's all just sheep. It's all like no, no death, no animal death. It doesn't work that all way. All animal sheep. <laughs> they, I have a theory that <laughs> evolution ve- disagrees. Ve- vegans have a dislike of nature. They, they, they feed them. They, they pretend that they're like all oh, save the planet. Yeah. They're not they're, they're, They don't like filth They don't like earth They like things in tubes that's a good, And You know that's a good I've point I've often thought that's that That's a good point It's all processed they're food anti, Yeah they're anti nature They're not They're, they're just they're, they're not They don't love nature They're kind of disgusted by it But the 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 absolute physical representation Of the selfish gene Is the yeah. predator Yeah Well, you, yeah, What are they mad. talking about but They don't like it at all They don't want us eating meat You could make an argument for Have that Have you never you, seen a sheep Eat as young Oh god Have you, Do you pigs, know what I mean Pigs routinely eat their young When people say the prey Yeah You know Oh yeah. they're a prey animal uh, They're fucking killers In their own right? Everything Anything's everything, capable of it Everything people It's get nonsense f- tra- I've seen uh, Cows or trample a, a goose or something All gone And they're oh, they just fucking They'll trample it. it Yeah they kill it Trample it Rip it apart There's, yeah, no, there's no sentiment In nature No Animals like you say 
your pet, if you died, your cat would be eating you. A cat would probably start eating you quicker than a dog would. That, that, absolutely, and that's fine. A dog that's would have a bit of qualm. Works. It wouldn't enjoy eating you. Mm-hmm. A cat would love it. Happened to my neighbour. It would go for your dog eating my neighbour. Yeah. Yeah, it was a terrible drunk guy. Oh, he tasted but good. Th- I think they were saying the dog lasted quite a while before it started. It was on the ah, verge yeah. of death itself. Yeah, so it's like... Really and it only nibbled a bit. It wasn't bad. It. it was just nibbling bit they went for? Don't know. It's like those Apparently people that crashed terrible, in that though, plane crash. Can the, the Argentine... When you're in the, the situation... The yeah, when you're yeah, in the, the situation... Long pig. It tastes right, like pig. Salty. salty pig. But if you're in the situation, it's like anything. I tell people... And say I, I would be great in this situation I'd be great You don't know no, what no, you'll yeah. do no. In any situation But the one thing I know you'll do In the extremes is you'll be a human Oh yeah, and if that's, you have, <laughs> no, yeah We've spoken of yeah. this before You and I have never experienced hunger No People think oh god no no I've been hungry yeah. Oh you've been hungry you've missed out your lunch or something mm-hmm. I'm talking about hunger where you've not eaten For oh, weeks Oh no for weeks and no, we don't experience that. And this, there's people who do. The majority of the, the world. The majority of the world who live like this every day. Children, mm-hmm. adults, old people experience this. Going home at night time. and no guarantee you get anything to eat. Days go by without food. If you've not eaten in two weeks, mm-hmm. you will fucking kill for it. And those people are not worrying about Britney Spears. No. They have other priorities. Concerns. This is a well fit. This you, is a need, Western you, problem. You need yeah. to have a full belly to be such a complaining, moaning, whining bastard. Absolutely, and I would love the world to be complaining bastards because they'll all be fed. Yeah, but I watched the thing. It's about, a symptom. Watched the thing symptom. about to follow Berlin. Yeah. Oh wait. Oh, we're recording. We're okay. BBC. BBC showed it. Good documentary. But yeah. it was like diary extracts from real Berliners as everything went yeah. to fuck. Yeah. 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 So can Berlin considered itself before the Nazis even there was like the most civilized. It of was. The they had openly legal gay clubs. Yeah. They had They're just very modern. Very modern. Very modern. And then it just went to barbarism. But you see it nineteen forty six mm-hmm. and there's people a uh, going into the zoo and eating the mm-hmm. f- giraffe. Mm-hmm. And there's de- a dead, a dead. Somebody got wind there was a dead horse in the street. A horse had starved to death, mm-hmm. and everybody was down there just like cut. Him. And they're but, after the water, and the water was full of corpses. So they're all getting typhus. And you see a woman. It's a big tank or something or other. Fucking was the looted, mm-hmm. and she's an old lady. She's got her hand in, and she's picking stuff off the pavement. It looked like it was syrup or yeast or something. Or other. Well. The, the the reason that I think that happens, and people say the 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 more advanced the civilization, the more barbaric it can be, mm-hmm. is certainly when they're put under pressure. I, and I think it's just because I was talking to a girl, and we're talking about having like a torch under the sink or whatever, and she went, "Oh what? Mm-hmm. I a torch under the sink?" She was, "What the fuck would you need a torch at your sink for?" Right. Now, in case the power goes out. Oh, she's no concept. No concept. And actually argued with me that that can't happen. I have, in my house, I have about five torches. Um, well, and everywhere. I've got tea lights. I mean, and I've got... I don't, have, ca- I don't have any candles for that because they're not safe. But I have... No, no, I, yeah. don't, I don't burn candles no. day to day, but I've got long old school yeah, candles. But I do have torches everywhere. But she didn't have a concept. So... Oh, my God. If you have a society, it has to have a balance yeah. of knowing that things can be tough so they're prepared for it or educated on it. How long would it take you to eat your cat? Uh, how, how many days without food would that cat start to look a bit? Well, that's what I have to say. I can't answer that because I'd say never. I'd uh, just you, rather you die. Would, but a, you, you, you don't know. Position. You don't know because your mind changes. Well, the thing is, I said, can during and then when they thought we were all going to die in the nuclear apocalypse, yeah, and the, the shelters, mm-hmm. you have to leave the pets outside the shelters that's and right. have them in. Mm-hmm. Imagine all those packs of feral dogs going about oh in the apocalypse, God. being eaten, being yeah. hunted by a pack of poodles. That's something you don't get now. It's feral dogs in Dundee. No, you don't get packs of dogs because they're worth three and a half thousand pounds. That's right. People will go a fucking four, get that in the house. A forty-pound dog, though, just like that. Every, yeah. A scheme I grew up in. People would go to work. Mm-hmm. They would open the door, and the dogs would all be running about. That's the the, the and then at dogs, night yeah. there'd be dogs. There was mm-hmm. dog. There was a dog that just lay on the road, middle of the road. The cars had to drive around the fucking mm-hmm. thing. It was, in all essence, a wild animal. It, it was fair. Yeah, we knew. You knew that they all had names and we knew dogs, but yeah. they were all wild. They were family. They used to like, run yeah, up and down the road. They're a community dog. Community dog, yeah. That used to happen. You Nowadays, don't get that, now. that does not happen. You yeah. never see a loose... When was the last time you saw a loose dog? Never. Never. 
it's been uh, you, that doesn't exist. Quite now. jobbies you never see because dogs don't get the bone meal. Don't they get, don't get lime. The bone. There's yeah. no lime in the food spread now. They, that's they right. don't get. And no, you never see it. Never, never see dogs now. Never. See, there used to be packs around Charles. You'll see. Now. You'll see. I'll see. If I go out in the morning at the post office, I'll see multiple foxes. Oh, multiple foxes everywhere. Foxes. And I'm in the middle of the city. Yeah, and me. there's foxes right Going past about, my house. Right past. The, well, I love a fox. Oh, it's beautiful. a beautiful animal. Beautiful animal. And you see them with their kits. Oh, 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 wee, wee tiny. Wee cubs, oh, lovely. But the fucking noise. They make a hell of a noise. Screaming outside my window. It's a terror. Ah! Oh, it's a oh fucking night. night. And the smell of them in the garden. I've oh, got, you'll smell I've them, I've got yeah. one of those camera traps. You can set up. Mm-hmm. Just spying on my neighbours. Yeah, yeah, of course. She's in her 70s. I like to watch her bathe. Oh, of course. Who doesn't? But uh, it's in black and white. Yeah. Uh, a bit, uh, you can see the contours. Infrared, yeah. Yeah, but the the, the fox, you'll you watch them doing all kinds of stuff. They're very canny and cautious. Again, they'll come down and they'll, mm-hmm. you'll leave out food and they'll come oh, back. Oh, they're watching. And, yeah. and they're always watching. Slightest noise. But the following day you go out and you can smell them, the foxes. Yeah, smell. you can but smell them I don't mind the smell. Strong. No, no, it's, it's, quite a, it's a wild smell. It's a wild animal. It's a wild they, smell. They have every right to be here. Did and I tell I, them? No. I, I also love, love magpies. They're, they make a right noise, the harsh noise. noise. <coughs> ah, ah, oh, the noise. The only problem with them is they're terrible for songbirds. They'll, they'll raid nests. They'll yeah, raid everything. kill everything. But I, nice garden, I thought, it'd be nice for a hedgehog. Oh, yeah, yeah. yeah. So it'd be good to keep down the snails and slugs. Mm-hmm. So I thought, a wild hedgehog's not going to come in. But they can climb if you put up a little hedgehog ladder. Mm-hmm. So I thought, I'll reach out to the Hedgehog Rescue Society. Mm-hmm. And I'll say, look, I've got this garden. Maybe you've got an elderly hedgehog, maybe mm-hmm. a disabled hedgehog, maybe a three-legged hedgehog. It wants to spend its in golden heaven. years. In heaven. Golden years. What a prick a man was. He phoned me up. No, 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 no. You don't understand hedgehogs at all. I says, well, what's to understand? He says, well, he started off by saying slugs. Hedgehogs don't eat slugs and snails. I says, no. No, it gives them intestinal parasites. I'm like, so you refused to give me a hedgehog. Oh. He says, "No, no, I'm not. No, I'm not housing a hedgehog with you." Oh, I'm like, "So where, where are you keeping these hedgehogs? You're keeping them safe from everything, so they've to now live in your fucking garage." But wouldn't they figure out what they want to eat when they're in your yes, garden? Yes, there's other things. Oh my god, there's there's worms, there's stuff. It would be perfect for them. Mm-hmm. I, I, my garden's quite wild. Can I've got log piles? <laughs> Oh, this ex is a middle aged guy. We're middle aged guys, but can you know what I mean? As none worse than a middle aged male expert. No, oh, uh, let me tell you. I just I'll stop you there, and I just walk. That's away That's why we're lucky. Uh, we know fuck. We know all. nothing about it. We know nothing. I'm quite I just proud walk of away fuck. as soon as a guy comes to me. Get, I just oh, walk away. Well, actually, Huey, it's always an ang a Huey. I when I was down at Play Expo and I was uh, uh, in full Derek mode. Mm-hmm. Uh, someone asked me a question about the internals of a ZX Spectrum. Oh, Jesus Christ. And I went, I don't know anything about it, mate. And he went, you don't even know what chipset was used? I went, no. And he looked at me, and I, in a way I've never been looked at in my life. And he no, just slowly... Me, disappointment. He turned his back, then looked back again. Then he turned his back on me and refused to speak to me again. Is that not the look your mother gives you every morning? Yeah, I mean, that's it, but... <laughs> That that happened, oh, Jesus and it was like I don't know, yeah. and uh, oh, let's just let's pretend. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. I don't know anything about. It. I don't have to build one. Yeah. Imagine yeah. having a pet that outlived you. Like if you bought a parrot now, that parrot would outlive you. Oh, it's frightening. I don't like that because uh, they can get really. They love years. you. They really care about you and everything. And it would just as a lassie when I work and she. In the cafe, she had a pet parrot, mm-hmm. but they had to give it away because it just became it hit puberty and it became just fractious. Oh, yeah. but it loved her, hated her boyfriend, and then they oh, had, had a baby, so they had yeah. to get rid of it. Yeah, but they're, they're, they say they're in, like an eight year old child. Well, this African grey that the girl I was going out ah. with had hated me. Uh, yeah, the, yeah. It was your... the imprint on one, yeah. they, they will always hate one of you, hated because you. Me. It partners with one of you. Oh, yeah. And the other one's a rival. It just always hate didn't you. like it. And he used to threaten me because he used to love watching martial arts films. Yeah. So when it saw me, it'd go, wah, wah, whoosh, whoosh. And I went, then it fucking threaten me. And then she'd come I've in. Got and a hell say, of a beacon. Because she was German. She goes, stop shouting and all this shit. And I went, I'm not shouting at it. It's just threatening me. It doesn't threaten you. Did I have numbers? Never in front of eh, If I could make them, it was an African a parrot, beautiful bird, but I hate me. I'd had hands. 
Are you, they'd Can be incredible. They'd make shit. Well, their their feet are their little oh, beaks are good. very nimble. I saw one part at once though, and it was. Uh, um, it's a lot of voices outside. Is what this, going is this on? Susan's having a gang bang. Yeah, it's, uh, if you hear a lot of voices, well, it's, a it's, it's a Friday gang bang. It's uh, just it's not us. There's something going on. Oh, and to my patrons, I've not done an on the spectrum uh, show this week. It's all written, just waiting to be done. But I've not had time. Jeez. The only time I've had off is doing this. It's been absolutely insane. I've been down here to one o'clock in the morning. Oh. I was here at seven. Doing all the work You should this sleep morning. here Oh Get it's been terrible bag. I've slept in this building a few times oh, There's noises oh. oh I tell you I think there's a I think there's a ghoul Who's the person with the, the Somebody really drags the a leg heels. Somebody Ka-ding. drags him Ka-ding. And they walk slowly with heels Ka-ding. on Ka-ding. Freaks me out Ka-ding. Ka-ding. I always assumed it was you Because there's a weight no, to but those I'm heels No I'm up to no, you're up a bit yeah, I'm up a well, bit But the thing is It's so quiet here You can hear people talking Oh you can hear You can hear because you can communicate if you put your head right in the toilet bowl, mm-hmm. save our phones. I could f- speak to you oh, through amazing. the plumbing. We should try that. Oh. Not in my toilets though, because the <gasps> Phantom Shiter it's... struck again yesterday, and I needed to use the Was toilet. Enormous? So I just had to wait. That... It's usually six, seven inches, a good inch and a half wide, and no toilet paper. It enrages me. Oh. Somebody's quite posh out We're there. listening There's so no one in. from this building They won't hear it No one from this building We're still recording We're ah, okay it's okay No pets, pets um, People get those What you call them Animals What? It's like a, a Associate Like a companion animal That's there for their mental health Like a oh, peacock uh, Or a A service goat. animal But you can get anything Anything Because I was watching them Was it Jim Jeffries They uh, registered uh, giraffes And they went That's fine Get it on a plane I have to cut a hole in the roof, but yeah, they're fine. Jesus Christ. Just get anything. People buy those little piglets and they're told that's a pygmy. Yeah. Like, and it just grows into a full size boa. It's the size of a car. <laughs> Who's the lassie? Shakira has just been attacked by a wild boar. What? Shakira. She's a small girl. She's feisty, though. Bet she I got like her between her thighs, broke its neck. Oh, God, that would be a wonderful sight. <laughs> Imagine. <laughs> we should maybe. Katie Price, now she's a piece of shit. You should fight her with an animal Say Katie Oh she doesn't have animals does she Pets Horses Oh Big horse person Yeah Hopefully there's someone else At those stables looking after them I know She'll be giving it coke Yeah Those big nostrils A horse could take a lot of coke There's a There's some milk And a melted Mars bar in it (laughs) Get hell Her kids Peter Andre I hope you're listening to this Get 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 in there man Get those kids out Get in there with your abs I don't think there's going to be A lot of issue in court With gaining those kids I don't, just, No but she needs to do she, If she's not doing Some jail time I'm fucking furious Well I know Right now If I'd been banned Aye. I've got no insurance Drinking nothing, drugs Drinking drugs And I tipped that car over You'd be in the jail They wouldn't even There'd be no Oh no. you're going next month It would have been You're you in court on say Monday I'm, I'm depressed there. I'm lonely Straight there There'd yeah, be, no, be no The fact she's even Going to the priory for a month infuriates They would have taken me To the sheriff that night Yeah And on Monday morning Sentenced and way yeah. No question Des- I despise the way money can help you It's yeah. a shield it's And it's terrible. not just a shield It's a battering ram Oh that's a you good way of putting it, it. I like that Offensive yeah. Yeah. Because you can You can use it to hush up Like you'd think in, You live in a world Say somebody abused you mm-hmm. You could stand up and say That person abused me No mm-hmm. They can put an injunction To stop you from telling the truth That's crazy That's a level of it Or not Even so if they're time. wrong They'll just keep it in the court And then just use all the legalese to What are you doing? You keep jumping is it just touching? You're a nervous fucker, no, aren't you? No, it's not nervous. It's something. It's yeah. my, my, my headphones. Can I hear? You, yeah, I think. It, oh, is it going off a bit? Have you got a bit of a. Yeah, there's something. Bad connection. Oh. No, it seems okay now. Okay, no, we'll check that. Yes, yeah, no, you think. But the thing is, the internet's good because people try and hide stuff and then folk just say, oh, Ryan Giggs is shagging his. Yeah, they just come out with it. It's you all just kind of keep it, and then it just because. And once well, that's why it's the newspapers there, are impotent now, because the the injunctions work with them, but the internet goes fuck all, you. All, all journalism in now is now is googling stuff. Yeah, you know what I hate because you can't wait. You kind of get to a story. You have to put it out there. That's it. it. I hate on the news when they say a lot of people on Twitter are saying, "Fucking what the fuck? bonkers, that's the news." Bonkers, yeah. And they're looking at Twitter. I remember Richard and Judy. I hate Richard Madeley, by the way. Oh. Shoplifting what? piece of shit But anyway <laughs> His drunk wife But the uh, They used to have On their This morning show 
they used to have an IT like social media expert when it was un- just starting yeah. and it was Rufus Hound getting that unfunny yeah. piece of shit oh, yeah. and he used to come on and say like oh this is on YouTube getting like a cat that can say sausages you know yeah. what I mean that was early f- people would you, the television people curated your internet experience oh, that's, that's gone that's just, yeah that's gone it's think about it. nobody watches TV when it's on nobody's like oh we've got to be home for seven to that watch doesn't something. happen it's anymore. all gone doesn't happen and that's broken down society because people had like a shared experience that's all do you want to know why why i think tv Mm -hmm. has genuinely finished now because i've started watching youtube more than television no and i'm the barometer it's not you no my mum next year is 80 right and she she goes to me son i'm done with this tv i just want watch netflix and youtube when my, yeah. my thing comes up could just get this out of the house yeah once the virgin's done it's just the contract's the end of the year could my you dad, just get my, rid of my it my dad watches no problem my dad watches the, the both of them watch because there's reason. nothing on she says I'm paying all this stuff and they'll watch, there's nothing on TV they'll maybe watch one show can there's maybe one show they'll watch no no remember the days when if you missed it you would never see it again you'd never see it but if my mum at 80s going I only yeah. watch YouTube She loves YouTube yeah. And she loves I was a slow adopter of YouTube I love but it But YouTube have got some good content mm-hmm. There's some stuff which is documentaries mm-hmm. Which are And they're done in a non-TV way It's a whole TV, new approach yeah. And ignorance is bliss in many ways Because yeah. some people just go I'm going to make a documentary And they do a good job They do a good job They do a good job And Lower budget just them with a camera It's wonderful There's a guy things. Peter Santanelli I think his name is The guy yeah. Goes around Traveling the Amish around. community and stuff Oh I'm watching it right now Yeah He's in the Amish the community Amish, Absolutely yeah. wonderful He just has a, a Open minded So what's attitude. this What's that Him and what's... Balden Bankrupt But Balden, Balden Bankrupt's Bankrupt, a bit cockier yeah. I thought he'd finished But he started again He walks with a bit of a swagger I'm in the Ukraine He goes a bit <laughs> he, But he's the same He just sees where it takes him Yeah I think Santanelli's maybe better He's more gentle He's yeah. more he did a good one yeah. The one on San Francisco Kind of oh explains San Francisco it's, it's legal to just shit in the street in San Francisco It's legal to steal and everything it's just you like, can, As long as you steal less than $925 Fucking don't worry about it But yeah But that's both Because TV it has all the the, the bo- mm-hmm. YouTube you're right into it. Mm-hmm. You, TV it's got the beginning and the end and the advert yeah. breaks and it's just yeah. But what's wonderful about him and the technology part of it's wonderful. Oh, the cameras. He's just got a GoPro. Yeah. And it's got an extra uh, mic on it just to give it. Yeah. Dirt cheap. Yeah. And he's making programs that I'm fascinated by. There was a there was a, yeah the Amish one really was an eye opener to the Amish. Yeah. Yeah. Gives a whole new look Because I was very much Of the uh, attitude That they missed They were sect And they didn't communicate But it's all just a big thing They can go from yeah. They can move around They've got their auctions And, and they help out A lot of charitable stuff yeah. I'm sure there's problems as well Of course there is But they're of not they're, is, not, but they're what, not as No It was that one guy He was saying So what could the world Learn from you And said uh, Well maybe we need to learn More from the world yeah. and Really open yeah. guy Yeah And it was uh, wonderful You, you saw the, the Saudi There's like chinks Chinks are like a uh, light coming into Saudis. It's opening up a bit. Women, there's drive. cracks in that. The, and it's changing because they've yeah. got a big young population. Yes, and, and they're going to have to adapt. Young people want stuff, mm-hmm. and if they don't get it, they'll fucking move from Saudi. And Saudi's not really. It's a funny. It's tenuous their economy. The Saudi. It's tenuous. That's very true. Once once the oil's going, it's like Dubai's fucked. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So they need to be holiday resorts. I was ho- hearing that Dubai is fake. And I thought, what, what does that mean? Well, that right. big tower in Dubai, when you flush a toilet, it goes it, into a tank, it goes in, and it's tanked out. It's, There's no the sewers. trucks are all queuing up every morning. Now, the reason that someone said it's fake, and I thought, that's a bit weird. All the places are built in between roads, but right. the roads don't pull off into certain areas. So you've you've got to travel. It's They just build something with no infrastructure around it. Mm-hmm. It looks fantastic. But it doesn't work in any way at all. If the seas rise, it'll just disappear. Yeah. They made that island that looks like a palm tree. Which is sinking. Well, that's fucked. It's sinking. But they could have quite as easily made it inland. Yeah. But you know what they did? What? There's a coral reef under it. And they They dredged sand, because it has to be a certain kind of sand that you Mm. build on. Mm. They dredged it, just destroyed it. But now it's sinking according to, I think it's a NASA satellite. The coral reef had been protected. Yeah, a half a centimetre to a centimetre a year. That's fucked. Now, that's a hell of a lot. That's huge. If your sea level's are rising. David Beckham was going to buy a house there. Oh, my God. 
There's a place down in England called Sandbanks. What kind of pets would they have in an exclusive gated community in England? Oh, it's got to be those little fucking yappy dogs. Or miniature ponies. You know, oh, those really seen, little ponies. I've seen one. They always look a bit funny, though. They're it looks like they've got a mix of mitosis. The eyes are bulbous. very pink it's and like a Pekingese. Like a... Oh, they look ill. An equine Pekingese. Yeah. Pekingese, they have to have C-sections. They kind of give birth naturally. Oh, that's horrible. Just I... like Katie Price. They give birth naturally. <laughs> they climb out her back. Oh, she like pods. Oh, my like God. Like a gremlin. It's so awful. It's so awful. Katie Price, I'm so sick of her. I'm so Can sick you know of I love these pets? What? Mickey, R- Mickey Rourke. Mickey nice. Rourke. He's wee tiny. He saves these tiny little, dog. <laughs> ugly little Mexican ugly hairless dogs. dogs yeah. yeah, yeah. It's He's weird. an interesting man. He's interesting. He's very... I don't know. With the surgery, getting the big lips and the... It's, I, think it's, he's, he's a mix. I think he's gay, is he? He seems would, to have a male companion that's with him. I would assume he was. Yeah, you but know, is I he holding on? Because be honest, Mickey, you're not gonna be a leading man again. Did you see him in Angel Heart though? What yeah. a handsome guy! Yeah, holy shit! And that's what a, a film! film. Uh, what a film! That's a devil one. Yeah, that's a good film. And it's Lisa Bonet. Oh my god, I was in love with her for Lisa years Bonet. when she was in that show. It was off of the Cosby is she show not with the Aquaman. Yeah, yeah. Aquaman. So I always thought one day I'll have her. Then you see her partner, and you went. Uh, you fuck maybe, well. You maybe struggle with old uh, <sighs> Momoa. He is ridiculously handsome, but his acting isn't there yet. No, he's, he's uh, his eyebrows. He's got on board. Gee, his eyebrows. That was because he was he was uh, had a bottle broke over his face a few years ago, and it was like forty odd stitches. Oh. So that's all held together. Yeah, that's real. He, he's in a thing called C. I've told you about this before. Yeah, the world is an apocalyptic apocalyptic event. Everyone's blind. And now it's like society is all made up of blind people. Mm-hmm. And sight starting to come back, but sighted people are like witches. Oh, right, okay. So we've got Jason Momoa, and his performance in it is really, is a, is, he's Baba, Baba Voss, he's called. He's really he's good. good. Ah, he's good. I think he's coming. His he's physical good. stuff, fantastic, but he's actually acting pretty solid. But they've thought, who do we, ba- who do we set him off against? Dave Batista. Oh, right, plays okay. He's his nemesis, his he's brother. He's another guy who's not a great actor, but it's building. You can see yeah, it's no, coming. He's, he's, he's got yeah. comedy chops. It's coming. Actually, in Guardians of the Galaxy, his timing's fucking flawless. In the yeah, way. yeah oh, he's I, brilliant. No, he's yeah. Good. He's no, I good. like him. The um, Mickey Rourke, have you ever seen him in Animal Factory? Playing no. the, the gay prison... No. Prisoner. No. Oh, Jesus, that's a turn. That's a wonderful performance. He was great really. in Wrestler. That was, I loved it. Oh, the bit when he puts his hand into the mincer. Oh, oh. I loved it. I loved it. I've, 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 I've got my mincing injury when I was cutting a chopped pot when I was a kid. Give me the you slicer. Were, you were slicer. sacked for sticking your fingers in the bacon slicer. Oh, the bacon slicer. But she was sacked as well. Bacon slicers are. <laughs> I made a joke. Oh, Wait, what time is it? What date is it? Oh, we it's made not a joke. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. <laughs> that would be my luck. If that would be the my greatest luck. joke in my history. greatest joke ever in front of people. They were arguing about crocodiles and alligators and the difference in them. And I said, "One will see you later, and one will see you in a while." And they went, "No, one has a short nose, another one has a pointed nose." And I went and put my head down in oh. embarrassment. I th- it was the greatest joke I'd ever made years and years ago, and nobody laughed. They had the. Uh... <laughs> Well, you almost uh, laughed, I but I think it was sympathy. Was but yeah. indigestion. <laughs> the uh, you watch you watch any of those ones in the down in Florida uncovering teeth like mastodon teeth, no megalodon teeth. Oh, that sounds good. So wild kale. There's a right, number okay. of them. Florida's bonkers. Yes, and you're like this seems to be the it's case. It's just nuts, but the the stuff the the fucking shark's teeth like that. <gasps> They're going into these little brooks and fucking pulling them out. It's nuts. Oh, wonderful! I like shit like that. Because because animals keep pets. Yes, they do. Yeah. Uh, the monkeys in monkeys have dogs. Japan. Well, I've seen the monkeys with dogs in front of me. They use they use the dogs the as point. guard dogs. Yeah. yeah, and the dogs go. But they steal them as puppies. Crazy. And look after them. Oh, they're grooming them. Yeah, but these dogs sit beside them, mm-hmm. furious. They're, they're uh, attack dogs. Yeah. Now, in Japan, little monkey grooms a little deer, mm-hmm. gives it food, jumps on his back, fucking rides it, takes off all R- over the rides place, it. rides it. Look into it. They're riding them. And they're, they go all over the monkeys place. Monkeys are deceitful. But they can get further than their usual distance, so they're actually using them for distance. So people thought that the first pet was a Neanderthal, maybe. No. Nope. Sitting in the fire. We, weren't, we were in the trees. Did we domesticate cats or dogs first? 
I don't know, but I think we probably domesticated them a lot longer. But did they domesticate uh, us? More distant. Uh, There's a theory that they've worked on us, you see. Well, their cats only meow at us. Yeah. Um, I think it's probably been, there'll have been cats hanging about. Yeah. And it works for both of them. Yeah. Evolution works that yeah, way. Yeah, it's, it's well, symbi- they've, they've kept down the rodent. Yeah, it's we're been practically a primary, yeah. symbiotic relationship. Almost. But the dogs have been helped as a hunting thing. Yeah. We've probably followed wolves. And yeah, probably, and they've benefited from us. We have, we, we have, we have pe- pecked at their leavings. Yeah, they've there's took, something taken happened. Some, we've showed up, yeah. But the fact you see a monkey, not an ape, it's a monkey. So it means it's happened earlier than that. Yes, Symbiotic and these relation. monkeys... They're coming. They're grooming them. Mm. So and they're cr- collecting food. What was that clever gorilla? They wanted a kitten. Yeah. She signed kitten. Yeah. They gave her a kitten. She ate it. No, she didn't. <laughs> she didn't. Do you know that uh, it was a Coco? Uh, that had a bigger vocabulary than a Dundonian. It turns out it's all bullshit. Is it bullshit? Yeah, it's bullshit. Why is it bullshit? Because it wasn't speaking. What was it doing? It's been trained. It's a repetitive thing. It's not. It's not spontaneous. There's a. A gorilla in America, I think, at the moment, and people go to throw out food, and it says, "I'm not allowed food." All signing, uh, and they go speaking, but they look into it and they change the oh, context ever so I'd, slightly. I'd have to look at the data. I'd ever so slightly, the they change the context. It's gone. Was that okay? It's gone because that that was more of a complicated. I think I, I do think it did a bit of a no. I don't no. think it did. did it I think it's all bullshit. So They're science. doing it with dogs. You can buy stuff for dogs at the moment, right? And it says in the press, the thing it says so food. It's the illusion. I love you. Uh, yeah, that no, is absolute illusion. Oh, I know that dog, but dogs are less. But it was more complex uh, with uh, the uh, ape. Uh, an ape will have more conception. They say that like even a sheep can recognise itself. Mm-hmm. So that can animals? But well, listen, I was no. walking downtown, mm-hmm. and it was at. Uh, Blacks and has the big yeah, window, yeah. Mm-hmm. and I was crossing. You didn't recognize, and I didn't know. And it took me a second. I went, They're moving the same as it was me, and I didn't know it was me. You think you're an old pensioner? I just thought, Fuck oh. off, I'm only 23. Yeah. According to that, that birthday card up there, I'm only 21, so that's good. Oh, God's Jesus Christ. How many days? That's three. Fucking hell, man, it's not long. Oh my god. I'm nervous. By the time this goes out, it'll all be over with. You can maybe get a, 50. a pet. 50. What would a 50 year old person's ideal pet? Like a very mangy poodle. He just oh, carried okay. about the crook of your arm. Do you, oh, now, this is something I do like. There's nothing more attractive than a wonky pet. Oh, yeah. It's got like three legs yeah, or something. You're yeah, instantly yeah. like this a one eyed cat. Oh, amazing. Wonder. I love all that amazing. stuff. I saw a cat recently and it was born with four ears. Oh, brilliant. Oh, it was beautiful. I like, have you seen the cats with the extra? F- oh, digits? brilliant. Yeah. yeah. Dog with the ear right in the middle. Mm. Just beautiful. I'd like an armadillo. Oh, yeah. Imagine one of them in your house. What'd it do? Because they just dig, go around. They dig. They dig. Tapping. They dig. You need to let them in your garden. Dig it. Wombat. Oh, square. Seen poop. a wombat eat a carrot? No, I unbelievable. <gasps> right, it's the like greatest pet. The, now I wouldn't have one because you know they're not meant to be like that. But the greatest animal ever that I've always just any time there's anything about it, I'll read about it, I'll watch it. Fruit bat. Yeah, they're stunning. They're meant to smell quite a bit. Do they? Quite smelling. You see the size of them? Huge. Beautiful wings and the, I saw oh. one The world's oldest Fruit bat in captivity Is like 76 years old Really? No, no it's not But it's like oh, You're old. a fucking lying cunt no, man Fuck it all Who cares? Jesus Nobody knows Christ. It Nobody, could be No one's listening But no he can't, listening he to can't fly facts. anymore But he's dead. Oh and They hold it And it goes uh, I see that It looks like one of those Crystal bats With the dark crystal Yeah It goes You're good son He goes I'm flying Look at me go And they give it a bit of mango And it and falls asleep just sleep. That's <laughs> right just, I saw that there. If you ever look up varieties of bat faces, mm-hmm. oh, there's nothing more complex. The variety, this, they're like a piece of architect sculpture. It is, and it collects Fretwork. sound so yeah. it can separate the frequencies. Yeah. <gasps> I love it. Anything to do with bats, you I'm know, all about. A lot of moths love these them. big antenna. Yeah. They're listening out for bats. That's right. That's right. It's to listen to It's an to arms their... race. Yes, that's exactly what it is. Because long eared bats don't have the echolocation. They've just got incredibly good hearing. Yeah, and they've all got good eyesight. Yeah. That's another thing. They've all you got good eyesight. You know how they discovered the echolocation? No. They got a scientist back in medieval times. He was putting out their eyes. Oh, Jesus Christ. Blinding them, and they could still fly, but then he would put, he'd 
to take their ears and believe their sight and they couldn't fly. Oh my yeah, God. it was horrible, Sam. That's horrible. All early science is horrible. You should read about the stuff about electricity. Oh, that fucking guy electrocuted elephants. Elephants and dogs and everything. Yeah, fuck yeah, them. Just piece of shit. Piece, piece of, of shit. shit. Piece of shit. What are we talking about? Pets. Yeah, so when it comes down to it, bats, I'm, I, I love anything to do with bats. One of those cockapoos. Love it. Not a cockapoo. Uh, uh, so it's flightless. Kias, the flight, the, no, they can fly. What's the flightless parrot? And lives in oh, New Zealand. Oh, yeah, I know the one. Big green thing. But they're, they're randy, very randy. But oh. they can live. They live long time. They can yeah. live 80, 90 years. Holy what shit. What are they called? I don't know. A kakapoo. Kakapoo. A kakapoo. Kakapoo. Something like that, yeah. There yeah. you go. That, that's what you would be into. Or a, a sloth would be good. Sloths are beautiful. Do you know sloths climb out of the trees to have a shit? Really? Yep. They don't mm. shit. You think you would just shit where you, where are. you are. Slow moving. They come all the way down. They've shit got moss the on them. Not only moss, they've got a type of moth called a sloth moth that lives exclusively on sloths. That's beautiful. But That's they just use zero know. energy. Mm -hmm. So they barely, they don't need to eat because they're just, they're basically hanging on tendons. So it's just... Oh, incredible. Incredible animals. Three-toed sloth, two-toed sloth. Absolutely seen a sloth. The, I th here's some, we've been saying how good YouTube is. What's bad about YouTube is videos of cute animals and people say, I want one of them. Yeah, that's... I want a slow loris so they get yeah. stolen out of nature. Yeah, you don't want that. Stick... To fucking dogs and cats. stick to domesticated animals. Domesticated. Don't get exotic. And they've not been domesticated for a few thousand years. Don't get, like people don't get have monkeys. They've been domesticated and they've been partners with us mm -hmm. for literally millions of well, years. Well, dogs, dogs have benefited because an animal wants a secure source of food, um, safe environment. Yeah. They the keep us the, safe. The ability, get, the yep. ability to reproduce their numbers, and we've allowed that to happen. Mm -hmm. There's more dogs in the world than wolves. It's they have increased their numbers, it. and it's the same genetics. It's they're still a wolf. But this is it, and this is why I, people say, "Oh, dogs shouldn't exist. We shouldn't have them in no, that." No, ridiculous. we've lived together if since we were in the fucking if, trees. If people don't, if people don't have relationships with animals, yeah, not of a non-sexual. Oh. Like a donkey But if people don't experience animals And have that one to one And that, that thing yeah. They don't care about animals So they don't care That's You right. need to Bill Oddie said a thing People don't like grey squirrels Because mm -hmm. he says they're an invasive species And people want them all shot But he says But that's a lot of people's first experience Of a wild animal mm -hmm. In London A built up environment You're feeding the grey squirrel nuts Yeah That means you love this animal And you're more likely to protect the environment That's totally so it's true just, it's people And I've heard mm -hmm. The only difference between a squirrel uh -huh. And a rat bushy Is tail. marketing Yeah it's just bushy tail It's marketing Look at a rat yep. A rat's a beautiful thing. Beautiful. They're beautiful stunning. Thing. The yeah. one thing people I, I don't, don't like rats. is the tail. People find the tail unsettling. The but reason it's, it's unsettling, a, that's a genetic memory. Yeah. That's probably that. But, but no, rats, I love them. The, the people have had memories of rats and, and, and famine and, mm -hmm. and, and plague. Because they did carry it yeah. fleas. Blah, blah. Death. Have you seen a house mouse? Lovely Got it thing. in a wee clear trap. Lovely wee thing. They're like a little kangaroo. Not as bonny as a field mouse though The field oh, no, mice they're, have bigger ears They're little round things But little they're vole, stunning Little voles are bonny as well All these animals oh, are ev beautiful Every animal You don't get ugly animals No you don't You don't And I saw a thing where it was like You know it was one of those apes The proboscis one It was ah, a huge nose And people saying Look how ugly it is It's fucking amazing They can swim You can't take your eyes off No they're it. incredible just, things Yeah Incredible Beautiful things. If you see those Pets. manta rays The sea Because oh. people think it like Fish are like vegetables they don't yeah, treat them with any respect. That's right. They've got complicated existences. That's incredible. Incredible. And they've been doing their thing long before us. That's right. The that's seas right. where everyone came from. That's right. The vegetables are here in Dundee. Yeah. Drinking after Funnily, shave. they don't eat vegetables, but they're no, not they special. No, they don't eat vegetables. Oh, uh, until next time, ladies and gentlemen. Wash your balls. If Don't, don't get any animal hair balls. on your balls. Wash your balls. Do you know what my boy does? You know how oh, you can't God. go near a cat's lower belly or genitals or anything when you're clapping them accidentally battery's almost running out oh, we're Jesus. doing perfect uh -huh. my boy when i got him he got his balls removed uh -huh. and i said just check there's no infection so i did see now you can clap them all over he doesn't move until next time i shouldn't have said that does until he, next does time he clap you as well yeah a little bit please pause wash your balls forget i said that bye <laughs> <Later>. <laughs>